Hey guys, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. Uh, my name is Napo. In the mail, I just received the Orphan Espresso Lido 3 manual hand grinder. And um, I've seen a lot of videos on it, a lot of people covering it and breaking it apart and mixing pieces with the Lido 2. Awesome. Um, but I'm not sure if I've seen anyone uh, try to pull an espresso shot. Uh, grinding with this so I'm gonna attempt to do that today I'll be using the Breville BES 840 XL otherwise known as the Breville infuser to pull the shot so we know that this is a great uh, manual hand grinder and um, there's, there's other videos on it it's the Orphan Espresso Lido 3 manual hand grinder and it's extremely precise accurate um, solid this thing is like a five out of five star um, so let's see what it has so this is my home setup um, I typically use the Rancilio Rocky Dosalis um, coffee grinder for both espresso and um, pretty much every other brew method um, this is the Breville infuser okay um, it's a great beginner's um, espresso machine. Um, I've tasted a lot of coffees with this thing and it's pulled great shots. It, it has done me well. I think I've outgrown it a little bit but I have to make do with what I have. So we'll be using um, this is a India Uganda blend. It's called the Wild Huntsman. It's by Oslo Coffee Roasters over at Brooklyn. Brooklyn, New York that is. Um, responsible roasters good stuff I've already tasted this thing it's amazing so let's get to it let's, let's get this thing to work so I, I'm gonna put 18 grams of espresso in my porta filter okay so I'm gonna probably put 20 22 grams of beans inside yeah so So as you can see, I now have 22 grams of coffee into the uh, chamber here of the Lido 3 and I'm ready to get at it. Okay, so I've decided to time this thing just so that you know more or less how long it takes to um, grind for espresso. Um, I forgot to mention that I kind of said, I just guessed a level. This is, this would be 0 or 1 and I'm kind of just like slightly over kind of just like slightly over here um, this would be like half of one full turn uh, I guess I'm at a quarter yeah this this is stepless there's no numbers so it's kind of like a guessing game if you hit a sweet spot save it I don't know mark it do something uh, but let's give it a shot I'm gonna start the time right here three two one very easy to grind Gotta find a sweet spot. Do the workout. Alright, getting easier. There it is. It's done. Cool. Let's make sure. Now, this is when the top comes in handy. All right, put the top in there. Lift this up. Locks that in place. Let's see what we got. Okay. So let me just open this for you. that um, I'm sure I can go finer than this I hope this is good enough I don't want to waste 18 grams of coffee um, it's kind of stuck to the wall let me see oh no you just tap it down okay well that works okay here I have my portafilter and um, 
I have this, which is another product by Orphan Espresso. This is a stainless steel um, funner that I use here to um, eliminate mess, which this is a little messy. Okay. I just teared. Let's start putting these beans in here. That's nine. All right, 18 exact. Okay, here's my temp, nice and even. Um, it looks a little coarse by eye. I may have to go a little bit finer, but let's see what the machine says. Three, two, one. Okay, that's looking pretty good. I have pretty good pressure. 20 at 20, so 25 seconds. I like to have my grind, my espresso at. Okay. Wow, that's 51. I went over. Would you look at that color? I'm sorry, it's kind of hard to um, work and do camera at the same time, but all right, let me just grab one. This is it. Wow. And these are, huh, home, home barista, yeah, more like champion. Look at this beautiful shot. Wow. Wow, all right, let's taste this. Mm. This just may be better than my Rancilio Docilis. And man, all right, there's, there's like two things I didn't like about this process. Uh, one is that it's, it's a little messy. Uh, but maybe with more practice, I can be a little neater and um, a lot less messier. Another thing, it's kind of a long process, as you can see. Um, but if I'm in a real coffee geek mode, I would rather use the uh, Orphan Espresso Lido 3 over the uh, Rancilio Dosolis because it's stepless. Uh, the Rancilio has these little numbers and steps in between and sometimes if you want to get a shot right there, right on, um, there's no way to do it. Uh, it's, you either have to play with your temp or um, the amount of coffee you actually use uh, to get the results you want. But if you want a nice syrupy body and especially working with a, uh, you know, consumer home espresso machine you kind of want the versatility uh, of a stepless um but folks you had it you saw you saw the results this thing is capable of grinding for espresso